The Spectacled Bear Nestled within the dense forests and high-altitude Andean regions of South America, the spectacled bear, which is also known as Tremarctos ornatus, emerges as an enigmatic and fascinating creature. Known for its distinctive facial markings that resemble eyeglasses or spectacles, these bears are the only bears native to South America, and they live mainly in the Andes Mountains. They have distinctive markings around their eyes that look like glasses, and they eat both plants and animals. They are solitary and roam over large areas in search of food and water. They are endangered due to habitat loss, human-wildlife conflict, hunting, and climate change. They are also culturally important for the indigenous peoples of the Andes, who consider them sacred or ancestral. In this video, we will delve into the world of the spectacled bear, exploring its unique characteristics, habitat, behavior, and conservation status. Distinctive Appearance The spectacled bear's distinctive appearance goes far beyond its eyeglass-like facial markings. Every aspect of its physical characteristics has evolved to help it thrive in the challenging environment of the Andes Mountains. Facial Markings The most prominent feature of the spectacled bear is its facial markings. These light-colored rings, encircling each eye, vary in shape and size among individuals. The pattern might consist of a complete circle around each eye, a half circle, or even a broken circle. These markings are not just aesthetically unique but also play a role in scientific identification and research. Fur and Coloration The spectacled bear's dense fur is not only essential for insulation in the high altitude, cold Andean regions but also adds to its unique appearance. Their fur can be quite shaggy, with longer hair around the neck and shoulders. The coloration varies from bear to bear, ranging from jet black to dark brown or even reddish brown. Occasionally, you may come across individuals with a blonde or beige-colored fur, though they are less common. Size and Build Spectacled bears are relatively small compared to some other bear species, such as grizzlies or polar bears. However, they are sturdy and well adapted to their mountainous habitat. Their body shape is stocky with short legs, which helps them navigate the rugged terrain of the Andes. Their round head, short snout, and small, rounded ears are characteristic of the species. Claws and Paws like other bears, spectacled bears have powerful limbs and sharp, non-retractable claws that are adapted for climbing and digging. Their forepaws have an extra digit, called a pseudothumb, which aids in gripping and manipulating objects, making them skilled tree climbers. These adaptations are essential for their foraging habits and escaping from predators. Size Variation Spectacled bears exhibit sexual dimorphism, with males generally being larger than females. Adult males can weigh between 100 to 155 kilograms, while females typically range from 64 to 82 kilograms. This size variation is one of the distinguishing characteristics of the species. The combination of these distinctive features makes the spectacled bear instantly recognizable to those who are fortunate enough to encounter one in the wild. Despite their uniqueness, these bears remain elusive and mysterious due to their solitary and reclusive nature. Understanding their appearance and behavior is crucial for ongoing conservation efforts aimed at protecting these remarkable creatures and their fragile high-altitude habitats. Physical Characteristics The spectacled bear, also known as the Andean bear, exhibits a range of characteristics that set them apart and make them unique in the world of bears. Here are some key characteristics of the spectacled bear. Habitat Specialists Spectacled bears are highly adapted to life in the high-altitude Andean regions of South America. 
They inhabit a wide range of habitats, from cloud forests and montane forests to grasslands and paramo, typically at elevations ranging from 6,000 to 14,000 feet, 1,800 to 4,300 meters, above sea level. Their adaptations to these environments include thicker fur for insulation and strong limbs for climbing steep terrain. Solitary Behavior Spectacled bears are generally solitary animals. They tend to lead a solitary lifestyle, with each individual establishing and defending its own territory. This solitary behavior is thought to be a strategy for reducing competition for limited food resources in their habitat. Omnivorous Diet while they are primarily herbivorous, feeding on a variety of plant matter such as fruits, leaves, and bamboo, spectacle bears are also opportunistic omnivores. They occasionally consume small mammals, birds, and insects. This dietary flexibility allows them to adapt to changing food availability in their habitat. Excellent Climbers Spectacled bears are exceptional climbers, thanks to their strong limbs and sharp claws. They often ascend trees to forage for food, such as fruits and bromeliads, or to escape threats. Their climbing abilities make them versatile foragers in their mountainous environment. Slow Reproduction These bears have a slow reproductive rate compared to some other bear species. Female spectacle bears typically give birth to one or two cubs after a gestation period of about six to seven months. Cubs stay with their mother for an extended period, sometimes up to two years, as they learn essential survival skills. Threats and Conservation Spectacle bears face numerous threats to their survival, including habitat loss due to deforestation, mining, and agriculture. They are also vulnerable to poaching and retaliatory killings when they come into contact with humans. Conservation efforts are underway across South America to protect these bears and their habitats, including the establishment of protected areas and community-based conservation initiatives. Unique Range Spectacled bears are the only bear species native to South America, and their range spans several countries, including Venezuela, Colombia, Ecuador, Peru, Bolivia, and parts of northern Argentina. This makes them a vital component of the region's biodiversity. In summary, the spectacled bear is a remarkable and distinctive bear species with unique characteristics that have evolved to help them thrive in the challenging Andean environments. While they face threats to their survival, efforts are ongoing to conserve and protect these enigmatic bears and ensure their continued presence in the wild. Habitat The spectacled bear is the only bear species found on the continent and is recognized for its distinctive facial markings, which resemble eyeglasses, hence the name spectacled bear. This unique bear species is known for its specialized habitat and range. Spectacled bears are primarily found in the Andes Mountains, spanning several countries in South America, including Colombia, Venezuela, Ecuador, Peru, and Bolivia. These bears are highly adapted to their mountainous habitat, and their distribution covers a wide range of elevations. They inhabit a diverse array of ecosystems within their range, including montane forests. Spectacle bears are often associated with montane cloud forests, which are moist, misty environments found at elevations between 1,500 to 3,800 meters above sea level. These forests are characterized by dense vegetation and provide the bears with a variety of food sources. Paramo Ecosystems in higher elevations, spectacled bears can also be found in Paramo ecosystems. Paramo is a unique alpine tundra environment located above the tree line. It consists of grasslands, wetlands, and shrublands, and it provides grazing opportunities for the bears. Bamboo Forests 
Some spectacled bears inhabit regions with bamboo forests. Bamboo makes up a significant part of their diet, and these forests provide essential foraging grounds for them. Valleys and Canyons Spectacled bears may also venture into lower elevation valleys and canyons, especially when seeking food, water, or to move between different parts of their range. Behavior the Andean spectacled bear, also known as the Andean bear or bear of the Andes, exhibit fascinating and unique behaviors that are crucial to their survival in the rugged Andean mountain landscapes they call home. Solitary Lifestyle Spectacled bears are primarily solitary creatures. They tend to live alone or in very small family groups, with adult males and females coming together only for mating. This solitary lifestyle helps reduce competition for resources in their mountainous habitats. Territorial Behavior Spectacled bears are territorial animals, and each individual bear establishes and defends its own territory. These territories can vary in size but typically encompass an area with abundant food resources, such as fruit-bearing trees, bamboo, and other vegetation. Bears mark their territory with scent markings and vocalizations to deter other bears from encroaching. Nocturnal Habits Spectacled bears are generally nocturnal, which means they are most active during the night. This behavior helps them avoid the heat of the day in their often hot and arid habitats and reduces the risk of encounters with humans, which can be a source of conflict. Diet Spectacled bears are primarily herbivorous, with their diet consisting mainly of plants. They have a particular fondness for fruits, especially those of the bromeliad plant and the Andean sapote tree. They are also known to eat bamboo, cacti, and other vegetation. Occasionally, they will consume insects, small mammals, and birds. Skilled Climbers these bears are excellent climbers, and their climbing abilities are essential for both food acquisition and escape from potential predators or threats. They can ascend trees to reach fruit and use their climbing skills to navigate the rugged terrain of the Andes. Social Behavior While spectacled bears are primarily solitary, they do exhibit some social behavior, especially during the mating season. Males may compete for the attention of a receptive female, engaging in displays of strength and dominance. Vocalizations Spectacled bears communicate with each other through various vocalizations, including roars, huffs, and grunts. These vocalizations are often used during interactions with other bears, particularly during the breeding season. Reproduction and Parenting after a gestation period of approximately seven to eight months, female spectacled bears give birth to one or two cubs, typically in a secluded den. The cubs are born blind and helpless and rely on their mother for nourishment and protection. Cubs stay with their mothers for an extended period, often up to two years, learning essential survival skills before becoming independent. Conservation Spectacled bears are listed as vulnerable by the International Union for Conservation of Nature, IUCN, due to habitat loss, poaching, and human-wildlife conflicts. Conservation efforts are critical to protect their populations and the fragile ecosystems they inhabit. The behavior of spectacled bears is shaped by their unique environment and the challenges they face in the Andean mountains. Their solitary nature, Climbing skills, dietary preferences, and parenting behaviors are all adaptations that have helped them thrive in a rugged and often challenging habitat. However, the conservation of these remarkable creatures is essential to ensure their continued survival in the wild. Reproduction and Life Cycle The spectacled bear is a unique and charismatic species native to the cloud forests and high-altitude regions of South America. These bears are not only the only bear species found in South America but are also the smallest bear species globally. 
Understanding the reproduction and life cycle of spectacled bears is crucial for their conservation, as this information helps researchers and conservationists make informed decisions to protect these incredible animals. Reproduction Spectacled bears, like many other mammals, have a reproductive process that includes mating, gestation, and the birth of cubs. Here is an overview of their reproduction. Mating Spectacled bears are primarily solitary animals, with adults leading solitary lives outside of the breeding season. Mating usually occurs between April and June when bears travel to find a mate. While females may tolerate the presence of males during this period, they are generally solitary throughout the rest of the year. Gestation after mating, female spectacle bears undergo a gestation period that typically lasts between five and seven months, with variations based on environmental conditions and individual bears. During gestation, pregnant females prepare for the upcoming birth by creating a den or nest. Cub birth Spectacled bear cubs are born between November and February, although birth timing can vary. Litters typically consist of one to three cubs, with twins being the most common. Cubs are born blind, hairless, and completely dependent on their mother for nourishment and protection. Life cycle The life cycle of a spectacled bear is characterized by distinct stages, from birth to adulthood. Cubs remain in the den with their mother for the first few months of life. During this time, the mother provides them with milk and constant care. Cubs are entirely reliant on their mother's protection and sustenance. As cubs grow, they become more active and start exploring their surroundings. They learn essential skills such as climbing trees and foraging for food. The mother continues to care for and protect her cubs during this stage, which lasts for about a year and a half. Around 1.5 to 2 years of age, young spectacled bears become more independent. They gradually leave their mother's territory to establish their own home range, which can be as large as 100 square kilometers. This phase marks the beginning of their solitary adult life. At around 3 to 4 years old, spectacled bears reach sexual maturity and are ready to mate. They will continue their solitary existence, except during the mating season when they seek out potential partners. Female spectacled bears tend to reproduce less frequently than males, often having cubs every two to three years. Understanding the reproduction and life cycle of spectacled bears is essential for their conservation. This knowledge allows researchers and conservationists to identify key habitats, protect den sites, and implement strategies to minimize human disturbances during critical times like cub rearing and mating. Furthermore, it aids in assessing the population health and trends of this endangered species. The reproduction and life cycle of the spectacled bear are fascinating aspects of this unique and critically endangered species. From the solitary lifestyle of adults to the vulnerability of cubs during their early stages, these bears face numerous challenges in their struggle for survival. By studying and protecting these magnificent animals, we can contribute to their conservation and ensure a brighter future for the Andean bear in the wild. Conservation Status The spectacled bear is classified as vulnerable on the IUCN Red List of Threatened Species. The main threats to its survival are habitat loss and fragmentation, human-wildlife conflict, poaching and illegal trade. According to some estimates, there are only between 2,500 and 10,000 spectacled bears left in the wild. Habitat loss and fragmentation are caused by deforestation, agriculture, mining, road construction and other human activities that reduce and isolate the bear's natural range. This makes it harder for the bears to find food, shelter, and mates, and exposes them to more human disturbance and competition with other animals. Human-wildlife conflict occurs when bears raid crops or livestock, causing damage and losses to local farmers. 
This can lead to retaliation killings or capture of bears by angry or fearful people. Some people also hunt bears for their meat, fur, claws or gallbladders, which are used in traditional medicine or sold on the black market. Illegal trade involves the capture and sale of live bears or their parts for zoos, circuses, pets or trophies. This is a serious threat to the spectacled bear population as it reduces their genetic diversity and increases their vulnerability to diseases and stress. There are several conservation efforts underway to protect the spectacled bear and its habitat. Some of these include Establishing and managing protected areas that cover the bear's core habitat and corridors. Promoting sustainable land use practices that minimize deforestation and degradation of the bear's habitat. Reducing human-bear conflict by improving crop protection methods, providing compensation for losses, raising awareness, and promoting coexistence. Strengthening law enforcement and monitoring to prevent poaching and illegal trade of bears and their parts. Supporting research and education on the ecology, behavior, and conservation status of the spectacled bear. Engaging local communities and stakeholders in conservation initiatives and providing alternative livelihoods. The spectacled bear is an important part of the biodiversity and culture of South America. It plays a key role in maintaining the health and balance of its ecosystem by dispersing seeds, pollinating plants, and controlling pests. It is also a symbol of strength, wisdom, and spirituality for many indigenous peoples. By conserving the spectacled bear, we are not only saving a unique and charismatic animal, but also preserving a rich and diverse natural heritage for future generations. That's all for now and thank you for watching. If you enjoyed our video and appreciate it, please take a moment to give it a like and write your thoughts and suggestions as a comment and please help us grow by subscribing to our channel and sharing it to your friends and family.